I'm Matt Hansen. We're here at Red Mountain, BC for the 18th annual Powder Week. We just had four days of some of the best skiing that we could ever have hoped for. Today was an epic powder day. The way Powder Week works is we have all the brands come in with their new skis that are coming out next fall. Then we bring in what's called the Powder Union, and they come from all different walks of life to help us ski the skis at Powder Week. There's teachers, there's someone who owns a hot tub cleaning company, and groomer mechanics, and a lot of them are also our writers and contributors for Powder Magazine. And we get real feedback from real skiers. They're not paid to ski, they're just ski like you and I do. And so you talk about it on the chairlift, and at Red Mountain they have these awesome old slow chairlifts. And you get off and then you go and ski that ski that you just talked about. So you're learning about the product, but you're also learning about who that person is and why they're doing what they do for a ski company. Powder Week's important to us because not only is it kind of the foundation of our North American existence, but uh, it's really about the, the community here, all the skiers from all over that we, we've met over the years. It's definitely really important for our brand. Yeah. These videos, what people are testing, the feedback that we get on the chairlift. It's a good opportunity for us to test our skis against really good skiers and see what other brands are doing and have a good time with a lot of great people in this industry. This year, the terrain's so different. It's definitely much more technical terrain, tight tree skiing, super steep, really featured, really playful. This is such an incredible place to test skis. When you're skiing with someone who built the ski, you get to learn like what were their intentions behind a ski design. This was the whole reason why we started Powder Week 18 years ago. Uh, the editors at the time felt that there was, in the ski industry, too much talk and not enough action. The idea was to build this community of skiers and it comes from good people going out skiing together and skiing really fast, being really passionate about what they do and that vibe just kind of gets goes through the roof, especially on a powder day. <laughs>